What's up guys, it is Super here and I'll bring you guys this video to talk about the phase one invite only recruitment challenge and if you guys saw my video from yesterday, I actually uploaded a video called another phase RC, but I had made that video the day of uh, Banks's return video. So it was the day before he actually uploaded his uh, information on what they're thinking of doing for this RC. So, you know, in my video, I was just speculating on what CODs it was going to be on and if it was going to be like a full blown phase five recruitment challenge. But of course, uh, you know, Banks yesterday uploaded a full information video on what he's thinking of or what phase is thinking of doing at the moment. Of course, he wrote a comment in the comment section of his own video saying that, uh, you know, this is just a rough plan of what they're doing. So things might change leading up to the recruitment challenge, but it's going to happen. And the crazy thing is, is that it's going to be an invite only recruitment challenge. So it's not going to be a full blown phase five RC where you have rounds and stuff like that. Um, it's not going to be like 5,000 people entering in this RC. It's going to be the top, the phase five top 100. And, uh, you know, from what Banks said, uh, people who have uh, quit or stopped, you know, playing COD or uploading videos consistently are going to get cut from, uh, you know, the list. And he's going to add people who, uh, you know, FaZe might be interested in seeing them compete. And that is crazy. That is going to be such an entertaining competition. Just imagine that the phase five top 100, all those insane players getting split up into two different teams, going for Cliff for a specific amount of time, and then putting out a team Taj each on phase clans channel. Definitely sounds like a lot of fun. And it sounds like something people really, really get excited for. Not only that, but once the two team Tajs are up, whatever, uh, you know, the criteria is for voting, either it's just phase clan picking which team Taj is the best, or it's, uh, you know, fan voted. The people who are part of the winning team, the winning team Taj are going to compete against each other in another private RC. And out of all of those guys from that winning team Taj, FaZe is only going to pick up one guy, just one person. That's what's called hashtag phase one. And that is crazy. That is a lot of competition for one spot. All those, uh, you know, 100 guys or however many people phase picks to, you know, compete against each other in, uh, you know, separate teams. Out of all of those guys, it's going to be one person. It's going to be really crazy. Whoever actually wins off this phase one is going to have so much hype around their name. It's going to be insane. It's definitely going to be a lot of fun. And I really can't wait till, uh, you know, more information is released from the leaders of phase. And, you know, once we approach advanced warfare, I guess we'll learn more information. But one thing that's really disappointing for me is that, uh, you know, the, the competition is not going to be only advanced warfare. And I do understand where uh you know banks is coming from because the last two months of uh you know a call of duty before the new cod comes out is just completely dead like no one is really interested too much in uh, older cods anymore so you know that's definitely a good way to spice up uh the older cods for the last two months to have another phase rc but uh that's gonna be it i hope you enjoyed the video and i will see you guys later